I'm uh, Farid Mohammed. I'm from Kuwait. I'm studying Master of Science in uh, Electronics Engineering at Bangor University. I graduated from college called Algonquin College in Canada and uh, frankly I went back and I uh, worked at the Information Ministry, Kuwait Information Ministry. And uh, frankly, after a number of years, you know, I thought, you know, it's good to always advance. And it was re really like a personal ambition, you know. So here I am, I went to Bangor, and I got graduated from Bangor uh, as an electronics engineer with a first class degree. And it was an amazing experience. You know, I, I was like that night sitting, applying through the net, then I looked at the map and I went, oh, Bangor, small city. And then I searched more, it says, city of learning. Then I went to the webcam and I searched. And I said, wow, this is amazing. It's very small. And I love small places. You feel comfortable. And also, if you look at the building of the Bangor University, it tells you a lot of history. And this is like amazing. That would really catch me. And I said, you know what? I'm going to go to Bangor. MSc, Master of Science in Electronics Engineering. This is my uh, studying now. Take nanotechnology. I mean, frankly, before that, coming to uh, being in a master student, you know, I had no clue whatsoever what's a nanotechnology. Now, thanks to Bangor University, I know what's nanotechnology, what are the threshold concepts of this kind of uh, science, you know, and how it will transform and make a seismic shift for the world. The evolution of micro scale okay made this you know these are smartphones you know how small sizes pcs laptops and all that so imagine uh, when we go to the nano it's amazing you know i really gained a lot now uh, more than that let's go into micro engineering and uh, more than that, we go to applications like, you know, modeling and designing. You are going to be subject for a software application. Imagine you are in a company and your boss comes say, hey, this is the program. This is the application. Learn it and do this project and your due date is that. So this course, you know, really makes you uh, robust and resilient, you know, for these kind of uh, tasks if you go to the real world. Then we go to communication, we're talking about broadband and then mobile communications. You are really experienced and aware of what's going on. You have a problem, your tutor would be there for you. Staff has this policy. If you don't knock my door, I will go and knock on your door. And that's amazing. That's, you see, this is rare to find in, 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 in uh, uh, universities there. They try to help you with your project, with your you know, uh, courses, and they are flexible. And that's the beauty of Bangor University. I love this city and it's, it's, it's true. It has these feelings, you know, the peace, the security, the, the size, you know, all that gives you like this feeling and inspires you to, you know, go and read, study. You know, financially, it's very cheap. You don't need cabs, taxis. You just can walk. There are plenty of supermarkets and variety. You know? And also there is the uh, Upper Bangor area where a landscape, beautiful uh, hills, you know, and you see Bangor Pier. So people here are very friendly, and honestly, if I go outside Wales, I wouldn't find the hospitality like I found it in Wales. Back home, you know, besides my engineering job, you know, I do a TV program. I'm a host. Uh, I have like English program and a sports program. As a host, you know, there are, I'll talk about reports and what's going on uh, on a daily basis, sports, politics, social, uh, cultural, uh, science. If something, you know, a breaking news or whatever, I talk about it. I, I talk a lot about Premier League here in the UK. I used to be a football player or a soccer player, you know, back home in Al Shabab Club, you know. And, and, and that kind of hobby, you know, and experience gave me and made my personality today, you know, 
because you are a footballer, you know, you have this kind of personality, you are uh, resilient for problems, you have nothing, you know, uh, impossible, you could do whatever, you know, it takes. I'm going back home, definitely, you know, uh, my wife and my kids, you know, I miss them a lot. They've been here, you know, and for a while, you know, but then I, my, my wife got a job, you know, she's a computer science graduate and she had a, a teaching job, you know, back home, so she had to go back. Definitely, they like it here, but today the world is, uh, thank, thanks for microtechnology and we will thank nanotechnology later on because of these, you know, uh, devices, you know, which making our uh, Earth is like small uh, village.